afternoon, Chicago. Well, how are you? It's been five years since I've been back to do a public program in Chicago, half a decade, so it's fantastic to be back with you all. What I've been fascinated by, what I've been obsessed by for basically 32 years, is what controls the human experience. This weekend is about making distinctions. One distinction can change your entire life. A distinction allows you to come up with an understanding, a meaning. And a better meaning, a better understanding will change your life. When you thought something was controlling you, and then you make a new distinction, you realize it's you that's controlling you, the whole world changes. The mental emotional state you're in is the most powerful influencer of human behavior, of human emotion. Emotion is what life is. It doesn't matter what happens, it's how you feel. Like right now I have like 250 clients. I know I could make that 500 easy. Like I just have the resources to just make it easy. And I know the systems that I need to put in place to make it happen, but I'm not doing it. What are you afraid of? My wife. <laughs> mm. The inner conflicts are, on the one hand, I want to be more successful, and my wife wants to be more successful, but on the other, it'll take more time, and then I might not be there for time that she wants with me. Oh, that's a conflict. Called pain if you do, pain if you don't. How many follow this? Raise your hand. Say I. So he has the fear of failing, and he has the fear of succeeding. So what are your responsibilities, Jeffrey? Make sure Rachel is happy. Make sure Rachel's happy. <laughs> so one of the challenges right now for you is that you're in a place where you don't own yourself a million percent, where you're feeling like the events are controlling you. But if you run away, then you don't have any presence for this woman, which is what she really wants more than anything else. Come here. What happened? I felt all bubbly, I don't know. If you felt all bubbly. <laughs> I buy a ring or nothing. You know, did you hear what he said? I didn't have to buy her a ring or nothing. That's my point. You think she needs these things when she needs your total presence. If you bring your presence to this woman, you will light her up like a Christmas tree, regardless of that blueprint. You get it? How does that make you feel when you feel like it's totally there? That's <laughs> And the firewalk is just that metaphor of a breakthrough where you get yourself to do something you once thought was difficult or impossible, and after doing it, you get the other side of the fire, your brain goes, damn, what I thought was so difficult is easy. This is not a seminar about changing yourself, because you're not broken and you don't need to be fixed. It is a seminar about being yourself, which is pretty hard when most of us are living a life that's based on conditioning, not based on who we are. What's the truth? Uh, I'm scared to death of being financially dependent my entire life. Give her a hand, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Who are you? Um, uh, I am a daughter, a friend, a rock, and a I'm bad mamma jamma. Bad mamma jamma. <laughs> Chicago energy, ladies and gentlemen. Let me just say to you, I live to see you reclaim yourself in this way. To see you 
fully alive with no limits, just enjoying your life. Living the fight, Sid. person I want to personally thank who never expects it or wants it, and that is, I couldn't do what I do without my wife, Sage, who's the greatest gift of my life. We had a hell of a time here at the UBW, such a great time with so many transformations from so many different people from around the world, so I just wanted to send you kind of this highlight video as a kind of little gift to trigger some of the memories and also some of the learnings you had so you take your life to the next level. I'll look forward to our paths crossing again sometime soon. Strong and live with passion. God bless.